Alright guys, welcome to your ninth video and the first thing we're going to be doing in this video is working on some minor CSS classes, just the classes to style the dates, the usernames, the subtitles, and then we're going to be working on the main layout of the website. How wide is our website, what do we want to appear on the left, on the right, all that good stuff. So the first thing like I said is we're going to style the little itty gritty details just to make everything look pretty before we get to the good stuff. Now whenever we have a date to appear on the website, for example, um, this item was listed on 316 or this item was listed 10 minutes ago, we want those dates to be orange and bold. So let's go ahead and change the color to orange, which is CC6600, and I actually like to make them capital, CC6600, and we also want font weight bold just like that now aside from dates we also need to style offers whenever someone offers you a trade their item for your item we want that offer to be a certain color and I'll, I'll show you guys what exactly we style as offers later on but for now let me go ahead and make the offers class offers and I'm just gonna make the color and font weight bold except the color it's pretty much going to be the exact same as dates except it's going to have a different color so the color for this is 40 40 40 which gives you a nice well you'll see later on obviously now the next is usernames now I don't want the usernames to be the exact same thing as a link because although whenever you click on someone's username you get taken to their user profile I want these to be a little bit more bold so you can easily see when scanning a web page that the usernames pop out so the usernames are going to first have a color and let me just go ahead and copy this lazy so usernames first have a color of 006699 and the font weight let's go ahead and bump this to 900 so aside from just bold and uh, normal what you can do is you can set actual values and 900 is a really good value it's somewhere in between bold and normal now the reason I do this is at first I made it bold and it looked really weird and uh, then I was like you know what not as bold so you know that's the little history of what I was doing I'm just gonna go ahead and shut up now and style the next class which is the subtitles so of course whenever you make a listing you give it uh, a title like PlayStation 3 game um, modern warfare whatever and the subtitle might be something like um, only been played twice so the subtitle for your listing we don't want it blue we want it like a nice subtle gray so color and the reason that we don't want it just to stand out in a bold color is because that's what the main title's job is for, to stand out. The subtitle is just like additional information, so that's why we're going to give it a nice soft gray, which is 70, 70, 70. Now that is basically all the classes that we have to cover for right now. I thought we were going to have time, and uh, actually we probably do have time, but in the next tutorial what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be concentrating only on the layout. How wide do we want this website? How big do we want the section on the left hand side to be? Exactly how we need to place things and why we need to place them that way. So anyways, for now, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.